missing this time. <laughs> slightly that we're going to play some New Orleans blues. Yay. So I hope you're having a fun time here tonight at the MBS. We're so happy and uh, glad to be invited 
here tonight. And uh, yeah, we've been playing around town for how long now? 10 years, Gary? 10 long years. Now you will see at the front door there, I think this might be poetry, you'll see at the front door there's a sign saying the Jackson Four. But we're now called the Jackson Combo, but we just couldn't sort of rub out off the CDs because we changed the name a few years ago because we go from two-piece, four-piece. We've got up to a 20-piece marching band now, so the four just had to go. And um, it's called the Jackson Combo. What have we got next on the uh, agenda, Gary? Oh, yeah. Baby, please don't go. <laughs>
Cheap seats, you know. <laughs> so let's 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 get this sorted out, okay? Who's who in the zoo? So we've got the VIPs over here. That's right. Who, yep. We've got the beautiful people. Yeah, we've got the beautiful people over here. Hang on. <laughs> sorry, sorry. We've got the beautiful people down the front here. Sorry. <laughs> we've got the uh, we've got the trumpets and the table in the middle. So security, if you can keep your eyes on those. And of course, the people up there in the cheap seats, we don't really care, do we? <laughs> Come on, baby. Let the good times roll. <laughs> Good times roll. Oh, baby, let the good times roll. Oh, baby, come on and let the good times roll. Yeah, back to the baby, let the good times roll.
Says, I've been to Preston, but quite a few years. Yeah, I was in New Orleans, I think it was about five years ago, playing the conga drums in Congo Square, just down near the Louis Armstrong Memorial Park. And um, the problem is, I just don't remember being there for the whole week. I remember getting off the plane, someone saying, You want to have a jam? and then getting out of jail. And back on the plane, and I was told I had a fantastic time. And I think that's the experience that everyone has, really. In New Orleans. So, the next time, because I'm not allowed at the airport, I'm going to be walking to New Orleans.
you say bye bye, walk into the new Orleans. you know that uh, this is our last blues gig, even though we've got our, um, our roaming minstrel show and our clown act and rock band and all the other things, because you've got to survive, you've got to eat. But this is our last blues gig until probably October. So you guys are really lucky, yeah. yeah some of us get to travel. I, I have to tell you, up until two weeks ago, I still had St. Petersburg on the itinerary. <laughs> I don't think so. <laughs> All right. Anyway, it'll be fun wherever I go, as long as I've got a radiation-proof hazmat suit. I think I'll be, I'll be fine swimming in that by the pool. Anyway, you've heard of the meters? Yeah. You have. You're the first crowd who's ever heard. Every time I say that, they go. No, you heard of Neville? You heard of Aaron Neville? Yeah, and a devil guy. So let's do an Aaron Neville song from the Meters, his previous band from the Neville Brothers, Hey Pocky Way. <laughs> Thank you. 
together for Mr. Nick Merrick on the front. family are back in in the Philippines and guess what Gary they want those shoes back <laughs> all 4,000 pairs Gary of those shoes Imelda is coming to pick them up <laughs> and the, let's not talk about the jacket <laughs> because once he turns the lights on, you're blinded by the light, which could be a song. Okay. All right, I, uh, I've just completely lost myself now. I, I think I'm at um, the golf club. No, I am. I, no, I'm at the bowling club. No, I'm at the NBA. So, yeah, oh, that's right. It was, it was the jacket that did it. But I'm going to do something by Louis Armstrong now. Is that right, Gary? Oh, that's good, because I'd hate to... Get, lead Gary astray. Do you know what it means to miss New Orleans? Family. <laughs> That's 
Amazing songs that, uh, well, we're sleeping basically. <laughs> but uh, he finds all the timbers. Who's this one by, Gary? Yeah. Earl King. Earl King? Anyone heard of Earl, yeah. Earl King? So you, you didn't just got the band, you've also, they've also done Strong King. But you're going to love this song. Ain't no city like New Orleans. <laughs> Yeah, 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 yeah
On that one, you gotta know where you're going with that. It could be a train wreck. Now, not many people realise that this next song is a BB King song. Because if you just play this to people, they say, "Sounds a bit like Prince." But the, I reckon this is where Prince got the idea for that Kiss song. Aren't you there? Remember that one? Well, this is a BB King song, so BB King song way before then. Dance with me,
Down there, still call the Jackson 4 so you can get the original band. Down there, it's over a couple of CDs. So if you've got a CD player, then you've got a CD to play it on. We'll see you soon. For those who've been to New Orleans, if you've been to the uh, State Museum, when you walk in the door, the first thing you're hit by is Fats Domino's piano. Up on its side, covered in mud, completely wrecked. And it's such a symbol of Hurricane Katrina because his house got completely flooded. The piano in his lounge room went out the front door, down the street, and uh, ended up about two kilometres away. And was found about six weeks later by someone, thank God, someone who knew that it was Fat Stolino's piano. And they put it into the museum and it's still there. You walk in the door and you see that and it's such a symbol of the devastation that that hurricane and flooding did. It's dedicated to the man himself. That's Domino.
Yeah. <laughs>